Now we will discuss the ventricular septal defect based on the development of the interventricular septum. The ventricular septal defects are the most common type of congenital heart defects and it occurs more frequently in the males as compared to the females. There are two types of ventricular septal defects. First is the membranous type. Another is the muscular type. The membranous type of ventricular septal defect is the most common type of ventricular septal defect. And this occurs due to the failure or defect in the proliferation of this endocardial cushion to form the membranous part of the interventricular septum. So there will remain a gap in this interventricular foramen that will lead to the membranous type of the ventricular septal defect as the proliferation of the endocardial cushion was forming the membranous part of the interventricular septum. Now the muscular type of the ventricular septal defect. This muscular type of ventricular septal defect can occur anywhere in this region of the muscular interventricular septum. It can be in the superior part, it can be also in the inferior part, it can be also in the middle part. Sometimes there could be many perforations in this muscular part of the interventricular septum. These small perforations in the muscular part of the interventricular septum will give an appearance of Swiss cheese. Therefore, this type of ventricular septal defect is known as Swiss cheese ventricular septal defect. There could be an another type of ventricular septal defect in which there is complete absence of this interventricular septum that is the membranous part and the muscular part has not formed. That will lead to a common ventricular cavity and this will result in a three chambered heart that is also known as co-trilocularae diatrium. So in this condition there are two atrium which are draining into a common ventricle and this common ventricle is opening in both the aorta and the permeate trunk. So this completes the embryological basis of ventricular septal defects. Thank you very much.